MLB The Show is your home for postseason baseball. It's game one of the American League Championship Series between the Tampa Bay Rays and the Houston Astros. Hi again, everyone. Matt Vaskersian. Welcome to our special postseason coverage of baseball on the show. With me is Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak. And Dan, we'll start with you. This series has the feel of one that's about to get very interesting. Looking at these two squads, it's clear both of them have several guys that can hurt you with the bat. It's not just the middle of the order guys that you have to look out for as a pitcher. So the team that gets the timely hitting and quality at bats is probably going to prevail. All right. The stage is set. The starters get their final tosses in out in the bullpen. And we've got a good one in store for you, folks. Play-by-play -play is coming up next. Trevor Bauer gets the ball for game one of the league championship series here at home. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, listen, when you can go seven full innings like he did, I know he got a no decision in his last start, but it was a real solid performance. If he continues to pitch like that, the wins are going to start coming. Batting third, the left fielder, your dog, Alvarez. Bases are empty here with two men out. Hey, two outs, one away. That's lifted the other way out to left. Wall. Duque Wall. is Wall. in his tracks now. As he puts this one away, the side is retired. Astros go down one, two, three. We are still scoreless. set for the start of the inning and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder Rafael Duque first delivery to him on the way this is line to left and the Rays are into the hit column with their first hit of the contest so a base hit to kick things off here and there's a man aboard to start out there half of the second Hey, some guys can handle the postseason lights, and this is obviously one of them. Another base hit leading off for the boys. This guy's had a monster postseason so far. That is Striding good. in, Willie the Adamas. Goal. Willie Adamas. Throw over to the bag, oh, and late reactions, and they got him. Well, that's not a good look. No one likes getting picked off, but it's especially bad when it's your team's first hit. It's kind of deflating. Play ball. Three. Four, four. Take your base. He's out. Three. You're out. 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 Three. He's out. That's ball four. So here's the cleanup hitter, Rafael Duque. He singled his last time up. Duque. Hey, take a cut now. Get your cuts. He's set. Here it comes. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Strong will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Play ball. Out. Three. Out. Three. Ball four. Take the base. Yeah. Three. Three. Out. Three. Full four. Take the base. He's out. Digging in. Rafael Duque. He flew out in his last at bat. 
almost, Matty, almost went deep his last A-B. Certainly just right, missed it. Now, With this it guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the ditch. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard, this A-B. And into center field as he's aboard yeah, he's with a one-out single. A There's a hard-hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard single up the middle. Yeah, watch your lips right there, Dan. Sent it back right where it came from. So a runner at first now with one away. And up next will be Willie Adamas. Willie Adamas. He's set and the 3 0 offering. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with only one away. Well, they've struggled offensively in this one so far, but after that walk, they've got runners at first and second and look ready to make a little noise. Just need a big hit now. So striding in, David Peralta, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Looked like the cut fastball there, and he got him to swing through it for the second out. Really impressive pitching right there. Sometimes as a pitcher, you can get frustrated when you make a good pitch and you don't get that call from the umpire. But what does he do? He comes back with a good pitch and gets the strike. The battle, number 67. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Rays strand a pair. They're down one nothing. With the play, Corey Lee. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. Corey. Two out, nobody on. Lee. Hey, get him yourself out here. And solid contact there as this ball is belted high in the air out to left. Duque has to retreat to the track, but he has it to retire the side. One, two, three, go the Astros. But they're on top, one to nothing. Into the box now, Rafael Duque. Two hits in three at bats for him in this one. Duque. Hey, drive him in. No First pitch here. of the at bat on its way. Popped him up. Mayfield is under it. Makes the play one away. Unless there's an amazing turnover of this lineup, it's looking like this is going to be his last at bat. And I think, people, we need to take a step back and realize this is the new mark. He has the new all-time hit streak mark. I didn't think I'd ever see it. Ball four, take the base. Three! Ball four, take the base. Standing in, Jack Mayfield. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Mayfield. The 2 1. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. It's up and out of here into the archways. A solo shot here to left. As they take the lead, it's two to one. That's a big time bomb right there. It's about time now for the closer to get ready and slam the door on this one. Three. Three. Out. Out. 
Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with the victory and look on to the next one. This one, definitely a low-scoring affair as we get one last look at our final line score. And there's no better time of year to come up big for your team than in the postseason. And that's exactly what this man did. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, no time like the postseason to come through and lift your team to victory. He was certainly a big factor here, and it was pretty cool to see. MLB The Show is your home for postseason baseball. It's the second game of this ALCS between the Tampa Bay Rays and the Houston Astros. Hi again, everyone. Matt Vaskersian. Welcome to our special postseason coverage of baseball on the show. I'm joined by Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and Danny. An important ball game coming up here in game two. Yeah, it was a good start for these guys at home. They did what they needed to do in the opening game, and this crowd really showed up and made a difference as well. Should be an electric atmosphere again, so we'll see if the guys on the field can feed off it and take a commanding lead in this series. All right, the stage is set. The starters get their final tosses in out in the bullpen, and we've got a good one in store for you, folks. Play-by-play -play is coming up next. Rogelio Armenteros is on the mound for game two. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, this guy pitched really well in his last outing, only allowing one run. If he brings that kind of stuff to the ballpark, he has a chance to pitch another gem in this one. What's the play ball? He's out! Ow! 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 You're out! Stepping in, Rafael Duque, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Duque. Now here it comes. Second inning starts with a fastball that misses. It's 1-0. and And set up behind the plate is Kenny Jansen, as you see the rest of the umpiring crew there. Hey, the book on Kenny Jansen, D-Road, not a very big zone, but... He will give you that low pitch below the knees. Yeah, and he's consistent. You're okay with that as an offensive player. He wants to give that on, pitch below it, the knees. It, if this pitcher it. can execute consistently, you better make the adjustment. Yeah, yeah, great job. Hey, right some there. guys can great handle the postseason lights, and this is obviously one of them. Another base hit leading off for the boys. This guy's had a monster postseason so far. Up next for the Rays, Willie Adamas. He'll get to take his it's first good. cuts here. Really? Duque on it first. Nobody out. Now a throw over. And late reactions, and they got him. Well, that's not a good look. No one likes getting picked off, but it's especially bad when it's your team's first hit. It's kind of deflating. Play ball. Three. Three. So the base is empty here with one away. And former World Series MVP George Springer bats next. Now the 2-1 pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Duque is going to get there as he backs up to put it away. And there are two gone now. And with two away, let's check in with our up-to-the-minute playoff bracket. And you can see our series at 1-0 as things are starting to heat up here as we get later into October. What's the 
Play ball. Three. Four, four. Take your brain. Get on now with the play, Rafael Duque. He reached on a so single in his first try. Rafael Duque. Hey now, here we go. Has a look, now the pitch. Smoke toward the hole. Ah, nice rip, nice and rip. that'll get on through into right field for a base hit. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting. And now time will be called here as you see the pitching coach making his way out to the mound to pay a quick visit. Stepping in, Willie Adamas. Four for one here in the early going. Three runs already home here. Come on, big guy. Get your pitch and let it rip. Let's go. Line toward center field. Find and that's ball. in there. Find Base the hit. One run is scored. And the run is in to score from second. Now a 5 nothing lead. He not hit all that hard, D-Roll. He muscled it out there for a two RBI base hit. Yeah, I don't care, Dan. Lawn dart, off the end of the bat, jam sandwich, doesn't matter. Found himself some green grass and gets two ribbies. So first and second with one man gone. And up next, the outfielder, David Peralta. Peralta. Hey, let it fly. Let's go right here. Oh, and two. Here it comes. And the slider gets him swinging. Two gone. Well, I have to give credit to him on the mound for not letting that previous pitch get to him. He wanted it, but he didn't get the call. But I love how he didn't let it affect him. And he comes right back with another good pitch and gets the punch out. The hey, Number guy, 67. And strike three there as they'll finally work out of the inning as the side is retired. All in all, ten men come to the plate and five score. We'll move on to the bottom of inning number three. The Rays lead it five to nothing. Into the box, Jack Mayfield comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no doubt home run. A solo shot here to left, his second home run of the series. As they get on the scoreboard here, it's 5-1. to one. Ah, man, that swing right there, Dan. That had to feel good. You're facing an elite starter. You don't know if you're even going to get wood on the baseball today. You know, and that'll rattle you a little bit. This guy's been throwing the ball great, one of the top pitchers in the game. He's not used to guys barreling him up and hitting him in the seats. What the play ball? Ow! Ow! Three! He's out! Digging in and looking for more, Rafael Duque. He came through with an RBI single in his last at-bat. First pitch on its way. Now he extends nicely, and this ball is driven to right field and deep. And it's gone as they add still another. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. His first homer so far in the series, and it's now a 6-1 to one ball game. Hey, that's the price you pay right there when you try and sneak a fastball past this guy. Power hitter, and every power hitter in the league knows you got to start with the numero uno, number one, man. You got to get on the heat. Out. 
Coming to the plate now, Hunter Renfro. Now batting, right fielder, Hunter Renfro. Now a swing, and he gets him to pop it up. Adamas ranges back, and he has it for route number two. Play ball. You're out. He's out. That's ball four. So here's the cleanup hitter, Rafael Duque. It's been a nice game for him. Three hits, including a homer to this point. The last time that, Matty D, we heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will land untouched. Oh, and one count and the pitch. Bounce towards the second baseman. Scooped up. Throw on the second for the force, and the side is retired. So two runs on three hits, no errors, and a couple of men left. On to the bottom of inning number six. It's the Rays eight and the Astros one. Bottom of the inning now, and that brings in George Springer. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Swing, and there it goes. Deep to left field. It's up and out of here into the archways. A solo home run here off the bat of George Springer. His second home run of the series as it's now down to an eight-run ball game. Well, they're not there yet, but a solo homer to lead off the inning will do wonders for any team's confidence. We'll see if the next few batters can continue the comeback effort here. Just need to string some good at bats together now. Play ball. That's ball four. Three. Three. Out. Ball four. Take the base. At the plate, Rafael Duque. He'll look to keep it going three for four so far in the ball game. Duque. First delivery to him on the way. Into center field, line Round drive, it, base hit. Round it, round it. Boy, talk about having a day, Debro. He gets his fourth knock of the game, but mixed in with one of those four was a round tripper. Not a bad day. Yeah, you have five, maybe a handful of games that you can throw out four knocks throughout the course of the year. The Add in a tater to go with it. Short He's top. smiling. His food's going to taste better tonight. I got it. 0 oh, and 1, here it comes. Tries to dump this one out to left. Hard, That's in there. Hard. Base hit. Up, Meadows is on his way home. And a relay home, but not in time as he's across with the run. I mean, that had to feel good right there, Dan. That's his third RBI of the game and extends his team's lead. They might have this one locked up. Boy, I tell you, those are always big, those add-on insurance runs. Big RBI right there for a little bit more breathing room. Stepping into the box, David Peralta struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. And he'll strike out here yet again as it's been a ball game to forget thus far. Four strikeouts. Wow, he's just a lost cause in this one. That's the fourth time he struck out in this game alone, and that's not something you'll forget very quickly. That's about as bad of a day as you can have. Now batting, number 67. 
And he pops him up, drifting toward the left side of the infield. Bregman is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Rays will settle for just the one. Not too many more shots left. Home half of the eighth coming up. It's the Rays 11 and the Astros 2. Next will be the designated hitter, George Springer, who went deep last time up. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down. And a swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But it bangs off the out-of-town scoreboard. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. He's not going to complain, but he was thinking what the rest of us were thinking when that left his bat. Home run number two. Didn't quite have enough, so he has to be content with a double. Let's play ball. Into the box now, Rafael Duque. He singled his last time up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. First offering on its way. Hard hit ball to second. And that's through into right field for a base hit. The throw to the plate. Ah, but the throw will be well up the line as he scores easily. Boy, this guy's having a great right game there. here so far, d -Row. Home run earlier in the night, and that base hit right there drives in his third run batted in of this game. Yeah, you drive to the park every day hoping your rhythm and timing is on point with that pitcher's windup, and that's exactly been the case today. He not only the mixed back, in that big bomb, but now he's got three ribbies to boot. On, Already 24 pitches to this point in the inning. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Man, I love watching a pitcher that just rears back and blows smoke by a guy at the letters. That's the ultimate challenge pitch, and for me personally, watching hitters swing and miss, man, that's a sight of beauty. Come on, big dog. The center fielder, number six, David Peralta. Hit out towards second. Fielded yeah. cleanly. Throw on to first, and an important pitch there as they get out of the inning before things explode. So they strike for three runs on five hits, no errors, and a couple of men left on. 9-1-2 and two scheduled to lead off the bottom of the ninth. The Rays are out in front, 14-5. On paper, this had the makings of a real hard-fought game, but uh, paper and reality, those are two different things. They pulled away and never looked back. How about to a tune of a nine-run victory? Well, this one pretty much over before it started as we give you a final look at the line score here in what turned out to be a blowout victory. And there's no better time of year to come up big for your team than in the postseason. And that's exactly what this man did. He's our tops player of the game. And obviously, every game is so important in the postseason. So when you come to play like he did and make a big difference for your team, it's something that won't be forgotten. 